somebody who, who are the real architects of the spiritual nation that bloomed under David and Solomon. The message of Brother Theodore during the 31st night of the fasting praise and prayer crusade was an introduction of the way Samuel built a nation so that we can learn from him in building a spiritual nation. Brother Theodore started by underscoring that if Moses built a spiritual nation by making a people for God and a people of God, and David built a nation with might, Samuel built the nation with spiritual fullness. Indeed, what I told us specified that Samuel was a real architect that bloomed the rain under David and Solomon. He took a backslidden and vassal nation and brought enormous spiritual fullness to build the nation of Israel so that he produced two anointed kings. But I hear highlighted that even heaven recognized Samuel's girth in Jeremiah 15 verse 1. The leader further commented that we are learning from Samuel because it is at our reach because it is where CMFI is now. But I feel that those called upon the saints to develop a real relationship with God that will enable one's environment to be influenced positively. Bringing it down to earth, he asked why after many years people around someone said to be in a relationship with God remain unchanged. He called each one to honestly check the people around them, see what they are for their testimony of who you are truly. Another aspect outlined by Brother Theodore in his message is loyalty and the need to have a correct heart attitude. Learning from the relationship of Hagar and Sarai, Pastor Theodore brought out the disloyalty of Hagar towards Sarai, her mistress. Her disloyalty could be seen from her contempt towards Sarai. Hagar's attitude of heart made her lose much, but I feel added. On the contrary, relationships like Naomi and Ruth are to be emulated in order to go very far with God. Ruth, Pastor Fiora said, was loyal, open, and transparent. These imply that she had the dispositions to please God at all costs, even to the point of following Naomi to a land that was strange to her. Pastor Fiora therefore called on everyone to emulate Ruth. 